Hi. Happy New Year. It's such a great time to be alive. A new year, a new month. You see, this year is very different because it marks a decade. This is the second decade since we entered 2000. It is the 401st year after the slave trade or when the slave trade started. It marked a critical time for the black race, for the third world, and for people across the world. We dealt with the principle of time. We dealt with the permutation of time. Today we want to look at the power of time. Guess what? Time is God's greatest resource. It's as simple as that. Among all the resources God had given mankind, time is the greatest of all his resources. Time is more powerful than treasure. Time is more powerful than body temple. Time is more powerful than talent. Let me reiterate again. Time is powerful than, ta that, than talent, powerful than treasure, powerful than the body temple. You want to ask why? All of God's gifts or resources given mankind find their flesh within time. Without time, the body is useless. Without time, talent is useless. Without time, treasure is useless. Time is very powerful. You see, here is the case. Time cannot be bought. You cannot buy time. Irrespective of how much you have in this world, you cannot buy time. Time cannot be slow paced. You can't say because I am late, I will slow pace time. I'm talking about the power of time or the powerfulness of time. Time cannot be hoarded. You can't purchase time. You can't claim time and keep it somewhere that in case time is no more, then you leverage on it to gain gains. No, time cannot be hoarded. Time cannot be fast paced. You can't say I am late, so I will fast pace time. This is the power of time. In other words, Time is not renewable. Time is not transferable. Time is independent of us. A.T. Tozer, gleaning from his statement, says that when time dies, there is no resurrection for time. The power of time is that time is a spendable resource. Immediately time is gone. You can retrace it back. This new year, this is one of the things that need to be a guiding rule. If this is the issue of time, you see, we pay more attention to money. But money cannot be equated to time. You lose some money, you can gain much more. But you lose the time. It's a fraction of eternity. It's a fraction, it's just a portion of eternity. Time is a spendable resource. It's not a resource when lost, you can regain again. If this is the issue of time, peradventure, because this is the time's timeline, this teaches us that this year, you need to guard against how you use the resource of time. Here is how the Bible puts it, Ecclesiastes chapter 3 verse 1. There is a season for everything and a time for every purpose under the heavens. The power of time teaches us we can't control time, we can't hurt time, we can't drive time, we can't short space time, we can't fast space time. Time is indispensable to us. It is on its own. This is a very deep secret about life. Here is a deeper insight about the power of time. Irrespective of your educational background, your status, how much you have, how much you weigh, every one of us have 24 hours. The power of time. Time is a ground leveler. It's a no respecter of person. Everyone have 24 hours. The power of time tells us whatever you invest your time into, you become. I am a product of what I have used my past time for. You are a product of what you have invested your time into. What you do with time, you eventually become. This is the power of time. Lastly, within the spectrum of time or the matrix of time, there is equality, not equity. Everyone has seven days in a week, 365 days in a year or 66, 12 months in a year. Within the matrix of time, there is an equality. This year, this month, this season of your life, make the time, never to waste the time. Immediately it is gone. It has gone into eternity. You cannot grab it again. Because this is the issue of time, don't just count the time. 
let the time count. My name is God TK Menza. I want to be part of your life as you influence generations by taking heed to how you use time. Wherever you find yourself on God's beautiful planet, spend some time and subscribe to all Calm social media handle and my social media handle as well for content. Stay blessed and be faithful with your time.